Welcome back to the channel. Now, the main question I'm getting on emails and even on Telegram is people saying to me, what's happening with VeChain? Is VeChain gonna go to zero? Guys, calm down. What you have to remember is that when the overall, when Bitcoin you know, tends to move downwards, most of the other cryptocurrencies tend to follow suit, right? Now, this is no different than with VeChain, right? We've seen a similar situation occur. I mean, uh, from the start of September, we've pretty much seen a downward uh, move to the downside. But if you saw my last VeChain video, this was me predicting, anticipating the move back to the upside. And for those of you that took advantage of that and maybe caught some profit, congratulations. But now we're seeing the pullback. We're at, we're at now a very, very nice area buying area uh, at least i do not see price going below uh th this area uh seven cents um this is a nice area of support and hopefully we do start to see the reversal to the upside right so let's just scroll back just so you guys can see a bigger picture of of what's actually happening right so since the start of the year uh, VeChain has been one of those cryptocurrencies that has performed tremendously well and is one of the, one of the few cryptocurrencies that uh, actually bounced back from the 2018 market downturn, right? This coin has survived and has moved forward and even thrived uh, uh, throughout, um, you know, the market uncertainty, etc. So to answer the question, guys, VeChain, in my opinion, is here to stay it's not going anywhere and in fact this is one of uh, a cryptocurrency that me i will constantly keep uh you know adding to my portfolio and compounding over time now before we get into some price action make sure you like comment and subscribe and as always click the bell notification icon so you can stay up to date on all my recent videos remember guys nothing that you've seen in this video is financial advice so always 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 make sure to do your own research with that being said pause the video click the link in my description and join the telegram group because that's where you'll be able to stay up to date on all our latest updates news updates technical updates and much much more so do this do that right this second because we have some major updates coming soon so let's talk about some of the technical analysis what can we you know what can we uh you know almost what is this chart telling us at the moment right number one in fact price is moving up as we speak right number one we're now we're now back inside our range right and our range we have a, a range here between uh, the eight cent area, so just above eight cents and 12 cents, right? So this is a nice range. Now, typically in the range, we want to look to buy at support and sell at resistance. Now, because we're bullish on um, we're bullish on VeChain, I wouldn't really be selling at resistance at all uh, or anything like that. I would look to start buying at the support again, though, and uh, maybe, I mean, if you're looking for short-term profits, maybe there's a a, a nice Let's see the percentage gain. There's a nice uh, take profit area, uh, back up to the 12 cent area, which is a 50% move. Really, really decent, uh, again, profits to be made just by trading the range. Uh, so a nice 50% move, similar to what I you know, predicted here and did really, really well. We're seeing the same scenario again, right? However, if you're looking beyond this target area and maybe you're saying to yourself, is a VeChain a good hold for the rest of the year? Now, for those of you that haven't seen my recent videos and you may be new to this channel, I believe, and wait for it, VeChain can move another 800% for this year. That's correct. I believe VeChain can quite easily uh, hit $1 this year. And of course, this is if everything goes according to plan, right? If unfortunately, if Bitcoin doesn't move, the market doesn't move, then of course, VeChain will suffer the same fate. So don't let this get to your heart or don't feel concerned or upset. This is just what's happening, unfortunately. But if everything does go according to plan, then I believe we can hit $1 this year. I do see VeChain as a top 10 uh, cryptocurrency. Um, and again, we're, we're yet to see if that, if that could occur. I mean, our, our midterm target will be back up to all-time highs, 25 cent 
to be safe. And as you can see, that would be 197% move. So just below a 200% move uh, back up to 25 cents. So we've got some nice risk to reward trade opportunities here, but where price currently is, this is this has buys written all over it. Now, before I wrap up the video, I, I feel like it's incumbent upon me to also share with you a bear case scenario. So what could potentially happen if price doesn't move, right? If price doesn't move as expected, then maybe we see price go back to three cents uh, or, or just below it. Uh, and again, of course, that is a very worst case scenario. And I'll probably have some orders set actually for this uh, because, <laughs> you know, that will be a lovely restock. Um, but yeah, that's the worst case scenario that could occur. We see price go all the way back down to, uh, you know, let's just make that red. We see price go all the way back. In fact, blue, just so you can see it. We see price go all the way back down uh, below the three cent area. And of course, that will be uh, going back below our, our uh, that'll be going back to our, the start of the year, uh, starting price, basically. So that's pre basically price wiping out all its gains for the year and going back to its entry point, uh, which hopefully shouldn't occur. But of course, even if that does occur, then of course, order set, we see price snap back. Um, um, and of course, that will be a nice restock, a nice free 300% gain so for me i see this as a win-win opportunity just because i am bullish on this project long term but to answer the question v chain in my opinion is not going to zero guys calm down with that being said seize the day and don't forget to like comment and subscribe